Good evening, traders. Welcome back to the channel. This is Vishal, and you're watching Nifty and Bank Nifty Short Term View. We can see in the last four to five trading sessions the way markets were approaching on the upside. It was very very clear that the momentum was diminishing, the momentum was waning, the trend was up, but the momentum was getting slower and slower with time. Especially if you have a look at the line chart over here, we can see that we have a higher high in price and we have a lower high in RSI. And along with that, we can also see that the trend is up. But with this trend being up, the RSI is way above 70 in the daily time frame chart. The RSI is above 70 even in the weekly time frame chart. Prices are also looking overstretched in both the time frames, even the weekly and the daily and especially in the weekly time frame chart we can see that prices are trading near important resistance which is the 161.8 uh, 161.80% 161 fibonacci extension which is at 21000 psychological levels so basically from 21000 to 21100 or slightly above that it's a psychological resistance band and also fibonacci extension resistance band so it is pretty much possible that the momentum will slow down over here. The trend will remain up, but the momentum will slow down. And uh, especially people who want to go long in the market should avoid going long at this juncture. If you're holding long positions from lower levels, somewhere over here or maybe even lower than that, you can continue to hold that with the trailing stop loss. But initiating way too many trades at higher levels is uh, not advisable. And uh, if you are looking for immediate supports, then somewhere over here, this is a short term support. This is not a very strong support, I would say, but immediate support would come at 20,700, but a meaningful support, which can, in case from tomorrow itself, we can see if the market starts coming down, because this is the first day after a very long time, we can see a decent big red candle in the Nifty spot daily chart. If this momentum continues, on the downside, then a meaningful support will come at uh, probably around at 20,500 levels. Yes, the, uh, the support is probably 400 points down, but we should also understand that this entire rally is way too big in terms of size in comparison to the other swings over here. All right. Let's have a look at the banking pack. In Bank Nifty, what we can see, trend remains up in the weekly time frame chart, even in the daily time frame chart. Well, in the weekly time frame chart, we do not have any resistance, but in the daily time frame chart, we can see that if we extend this swing on the upside, we can have a 361.80% Fibonacci extension. And even over here, we do have a higher high in price and a lower high in RSI. Again, this is a sign that the momentum is vanishing, the momentum is weakening with the trend staying up. Not a very good time to go aggressively long at this juncture. We need some cool off. We need some consolidation at this level. Probably some profit booking also uh, will not be bad for the market. And if you're looking for immediate supports, all right, then we need to a lot of Fibonacci over here. And you can see that the immediate support comes at 46,550. Yes, uh, Bang Nifty will have to come pretty much lower over here in a matter of maybe a few sessions. And then only we'll be able to see some sort of meaningful support coming up in Bank Nifty. Now, well, today, I guess the stocks responsible for bringing the Nifty down was obviously the king of stocks, which is Reliance Industries. A little bit of profit booking was also visible in uh, Infosys. You can see over here. Even in private banking stocks, if you saw HDFC Bank, even HDFC Bank tried to come down a bit. And in private banking pack, apart from the HDFC bank, you will also see that uh, Kotak Bank did close a person down. Even this particular stock is important when the weightage is concerned. LNT also did see some bouts of profit booking. Not a lot, but yes, a tad bit. And even ITC. So these are the stocks which were responsible to drag Nifty lower today. And I guess uh, as a trader, we need to understand that if we want to see a constructive, sustained rally in overall markets for a pretty long time and some consolidation and profit booking, if it comes, it will be actually good for the market. So again, saying, uh, yes, if you're, uh, if you're seeing a 
sector which is trying to get ready to go higher with uh, main important weighted stocks uh, considering a very high probable buy setup then it is a totally different scenario but as of now it can't see any but otherwise i guess uh, not a very good time to initiate aggressive long positions over here all right so i hope uh, this video has been helpful to you to understand how markets can move in the next few days and try to share this video with other traders if you feel that this particular educational video has helped you to understand how markets will pan out in the next few days trade less trade safely thank you